Hey guys, it is the official seven month update since my knee replacement surgery. It is December 8th. As you know, I had my surgery on May 8th. So let's see what has happened. Um, November 27th, I visited my doctor. He said I'm getting stronger. He pushed, pulled and prodded and you know, did all the things took x-rays, the knee replacement's still intact and not loose, and he said that I was like, oh, that's good, I know it can get loose. Uh, so, yay. Um, I am not using a cane in the house at all. Um, I am using it occasionally outside if it's raining or windy or now we're getting snow here in Illinois. So I just, because I don't, I still don't feel like I have good reaction. I still don't have good reaction. Like if I'm going to walk fast or, or, you know, have to walk on ice, I just am worried that I'm not going to be able to react properly. So I still carry my cane, um, in those scenarios, but otherwise, um, Phil is my cane. I hold his hand <laughs> when we go to a store, um, and I use a cart when I'm in the store or something. So, so at the end of the day, I guess we can say I'm getting a little bit better. Um, however, let's, that was the good news. The bad news is, um, I'm still numb. I did, I did take the measurement of my leg like they told me to, and it's still seven inches by two inches, so maybe one inch less than it was, although I could have measured wrong. Um, that section of my leg is still numb on the, on the left inside part of it. The interesting part is the knee portion, the top portion, which was numb as well, is less numb. Hey, <laughs> but now I'm feeling more pain <laughs> because of that. So now I'm getting a little more achiness, a little more pain. I still feel like I have something in my leg. It's just so weird, but less of it, if that makes sense. You know, um, you know originally I said it felt like there was a brace in there, and now it feels like there's a little brace in there. <laughs> so, you know, I guess it is getting better. So let's just say hallelujah for that. Um, I did stop going to Athletico. My doctor said no more. Uh, just do home therapy. So my beautiful friends at Athletico gave me a program for home. Um, which I'm doing three times a week. And then the other days I'm going to try to do something different, like maybe my treadmill or maybe a video. Like um, I love body groove and I'm, I, I've been doing it a little bit every day, but I do like five minutes of it because I'm still not, I'm not groovy. I can't groove that good. <laughs> I, I, I stomp instead of slide. <laughs> so it's just, again, it's not bad. It's not great. I'm still, not 100% happy I did the surgery. Um, my doctor said to me on the 27th, he says, you're gonna probably be one of the year people, you know, that it takes a year before you feel a lot better. Um, still wish I could do a lotus pose or, you know, sit with my legs crossed. I can obviously sit a little bit with my leg crossed, but I can't get it all the way up and I don't know if I ever will be able to, which makes me sad because every January I do yoga with Adrian's 30 uh, day challenge. So I'm gonna still try to do it, but I may not be able to do all the poses, but I'll let you know how that goes in January. <laughs> so here we are, um, literally just now, people left my house because they were coming to measure for a railing. Um, the staircase going into my home is just concrete steps. There's no, there's no rail at all. And I just think it's better to have the railing put on. So we're gonna get a quote for that. Um, not only for myself, but like his parents are getting older now. It's just good for everybody who comes into the house who might need a railing, um, even the Amazon guy, right? So, you know, things are changing a little bit, getting older sucks, but it is what it is. So that is the seven month update. Oh, and then I'll just show you a quick picture of when I'm done talking of my scar. Uh, I really do believe the Mederma is helping a lot. I use it every day, pretty much, you know, unless, unless for some reason I forget, but mostly every day I put Mederma on. Uh, the only time my, it's, it's still weird though, my scar still gets really dark when I take like a hot shower or right after I've done my therapy, it's a lot redder, but then it goes away. So it's, I think it's just the blood rushing up there or something, I don't know. But um, otherwise during the normal course of looking at it, it looks like the picture I'm gonna show you. And that is it, my friends. So I hope you're all doing well. Are you watching our Advent series? I don't, I don't know if you are. Uh, if you're not, that's okay too. Don't expect you to, but um, we're having a good time uh, just trying to keep positive. Um, today's a hard day for me, and I'll uh, explain that more in the Advent calendar series. Talk to you all later. Bye.